Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and I'm back again with another video tutorial. So ngayon, pag-uusapan natin kung paano ba mag-multiply ng polynomials. So, sa video ito, pag-uusapan din natin kung uh, paano ba mag-multiply ng monomial to binomial, monomial to trinomial, at binomial to binomial. So before we start, make sure na nakasubscribe ka at uh, you hit the notification bell para you are updated with my video tutorials kapag ka nag-upload ako ng mga video tutorials. So without further ado, let's start. So to discuss this matter, let's have this example. So una i-discuss natin yung uh, monomial to binomial. So let's start with this example. Suppose you have here the problem 2x, 2x squared and your task is to multiply it to let's say x plus 4. So, paano ba natin ito isosolve? So, yung problem na to, we have here monomial at binomial. So, actually, yung uh, karaniwang ginagawa natin dito ay to use the distributive property in which you are just going to distribute the monomial term dito sa binomial. So, let's solve this problem. So, let's multiply 2x squared, 2x squared, 2x plus 4. So, in loss of exponent, it states that when a raised to n is multiplied to a raised to m, its product is just a raised to n plus m. Big sabihin, we are just going to multiply the, uh, we are just going to add, I mean, the exponent of these two terms. So in our case, we have your 2x squared times x. So, we, we are first going to multiply its uh, coefficient since we have here one, uh, since we have here the, uh, on the first term of this binomial, one coefficient. We multiply two times one, that is two. And then, let's apply this loss of exponent. So, let's copy the base, x, and then we are going to add the exponent. Two plus one, since we have here, uh, and we have here one exponent of x. So, we add two plus one. That is 3, so we get 2x cubed. Now, let's multiply 2x squared to 4. So, since there are no, there is no variable and exponent, we are just going to multiply the coefficient and then copy the, the variable and then the exponent. So, 2 times 4, that is 8. Since it's positive and positive, you copy the sign positive and then you add 4. To, you multiply, I mean, 2 and 4, we get 8. And then you copy the variable x and the exponent 2. So, our product here is uh, 2x cubed plus 8x squared. When we multiply 2x squared, 2x plus 4, ang product natin ay 2x cubed plus 8x squared. This is our final answer. So, paano naman pagka may dalawang variables yung uh, idin-deal natin na problem? Say, for example, my x and y na variable. So, let's have this example. Suppose you have here the problem... 4x squared y and your task is to multiply it to the binomial 2xy squared plus 3 3y, sabihin natin 3y So, paano yun? The same, uh, the same rule ay apply natin ng loss of exponent ano? and also, uh, gagamitin natin yung distributive property multiply natin ng 4x squared y sa 2xy squared at uh, 3y. So, una, let's deal with the first term. Ano? We multiply 4x squared y to 2xy squared. So, paano natin gagawin yon? Again, yung loss of, loss of exponent ang sabi doon ay if a raised to n is multiplied to a raised to m, its product is just equal to a raised to n plus m. We will do addition of the exponent. So, let's multiply, multiply first the coefficient 4 and 2. 4 times 2, that is 8. Then, you copy first the variable x and y. Ngayon, tingnan mo ang exponent ng mga variables natin. Sa x, meron tayong 2 and 1. So, we add natin ang 2 and 1. We get 2 plus 1 is 3. Sa variable na y, meron din tayong exponent na 1 and 2. So, we add lang natin ang variable na 1 and 2. 1 plus 2 is 3. So, therefore, ang product natin dito ay at 8x cubed, y cubed. Next tayo doon sa pangalawang term. So, since it's positive, we multiply it to positive, that is positive. 
So, i-multiply natin ng 4x squared y sa 3y. So, paano ang gagawin natin? You multiply first the coefficient 4 and 3. 4 times 3, that is 12. And then, you copy the variables of this term. We have here x squared, uh, x and y, I mean. So, we have here x and y. Now, tingnan mo na yung exponent natin ng mga variable dito. So, sa, sa variable x, since wala siya, walang variable x ang uh, term natin na 3y, copy mo na lang yung exponent at variable. So, we have here 12x squared. Now, ang y, since uh, parehong 1 ang, uh, ang variable natin, ang exponent natin dito, you just add 1 plus 1, therefore we get 2. At ang product natin sa dalawang term nito ay 12x squared y squared. At uh, ito na, ito na ang final answer natin. When we multiply 4x squared dito sa binomial term na 2xy squared plus 3y, ang product natin ang i 8x cube y cube plus 12x squared y squared. This is our final answer. Okay, so let's proceed to uh, the second topic. Yung uh, paano ba tayo mag-multiply ng monomial sa trinomial. So let's have this example to discuss the topic. So for instance, given, uh, binigyan kayo ng uh, um, problem na ganito. Isang monomial at isang trinomial. Your task is to multiply a monomial to trinomial. So let's say, ang ang, uh, ang problem natin ay sabihin natin 2x cubed at multiply natin ito sa 2x plus 4x plus 5. Sabihin natin na ang problem nyo ay 2x cube, 2x cube that will be multiplied to 2x squared plus 4x plus 5. So again, the same rule lang yung i-apply natin dito. Gagamitin natin ang distributive uh, property. Distribute lang natin ng 2x cubed sa trinomial na ito. So let's have let's solve this problem. So multiply muna natin ang uh, 2x cubed sa first term ng trinomial which is 2x squared. Again, gagamitin natin ang uh, loss of exponent ng sabi dito it states that if a raised to n is multiplied to a raised to m, ang kanyang product ay equal to a raised to n plus m. There is a there is addition of the exponents of this term. So, let's multiply the first uh, term of this trinomial to our monomial here. So, we multiply 2x cubed and 2x squared. We multiply first the coefficient 2 plus 2 times 2, that is 4, and you copy the variable x. Then, proceed tayo doon sa application ng ating loss of exponent. Sa variable x, meron tayong dalawang exponent, 3 and 2. You just uh, add 3 and 2, we get 5. Ano? So, our product of uh, the product of the first term is 4x to the fifth power. Proceed tayo sa pangalawang term. Ang 4x. Let's multiply 2x cubed sa 4x. Since it's both positive, copy the sign positive. So, multiply muna natin ng coefficient na 2 and 4. 2 times 4 is 8. You copy the variable x and then add the exponent. Since ang uh, exponent natin ay 3 and 1, you just add the exponent. 3, 3 plus 1 is 4. So, our, our second product is uh, 8x raised to the 4th power. Next, proceed tayo sa last term. Since it's both positive, 2x cubed is positive and 5 is positive, let's copy the sign positive. We multiply 2x cubed sa term natin na 5. Since walang ibang variable, and we are just going to multiply the uh, coefficients and then we copy the variable and then the exponent. So, 2x cubed times 5. Multiply natin ang coefficient na 2 and 5. 2 times 5 is 10. And then you copy the variable x and then the exponent, 3. So, if we multiply 2x cubed to 2x squared plus 4x plus 5, our product is 4x raised to the 5th power, plus 8x raised to the third to the 4th power, I mean, plus 10x cubed. So, ito yung product natin and this is our uh, final answer. Alright, let's proceed to the last part of this topic. So, we have here multiplying uh, 
binomial to binomial. So, paano ba tayo mag-multiply ng isang binomial so, to another binomial? So, let's say you have here the problem x plus 2 tapos x plus 6. So, paano ba natin ito i-solve? So, may isang method na ituturo ko sa inyo yung FOIL method. Alam ko, alam ko narinig nyo na ito eh. This is very famous. So, let's use the FOIL method with dealing, in dealing with this uh, example. So, have the word FOIL. So, ano bang ibig sabihin nito? Ang F, it stands for the front term. Sa ating example, ang nasa front ay X tapos X. So, therefore, our front term is X times X. So, not the outer uh, or the outside term. Ano ba yung mga nasa outside term natin? That is x and 6. Outside term natin ay x times 6. Sunod ay ang i. Ano ba ang i sa, i sa FOIL method? That is the inside term. Ano ba yung mga nasa uh, inside na sa example natin, that is 2 and x. So, we multiply 2 times x. Sunod ay ang L. Ang L ay ang nasa last uh, na term or ang last term. Sa example natin, that is 2 and 6. So, therefore, we will, we will multiply 2 and x. So, tandaan natin ha. Sa FOIL method, ang F ay front term o ay outside term. I ay inside term, L ay ang last term. So, let's have this, uh, let's solve this problem. So, our uh, front term ay x times x, that is x squared. Our exponents are uh, 1. So, sunod. Ang ating, uh, since it's positive, you copy the sign positive. Ang ating uh, uh, outside term ay x and 6. So, we multiply x times 6, we get 6x. So, nod ay ang inside term. Ang inside term natin ay 2 and x. We multiply 2 times 6. To copy the sign positive, so since it's both positive, 2 times x is simply 2x. So, nod ay ang uh, last term. Ano ba ang last term natin dito? It's 2 and 6. It's both positive, so you copy the sign positive. So, 2 times 6, that is 12. Now, hindi pa ito ang final answer natin. We will use the uh, combining like terms. So, hanap kayo ng uh, term na pareho. Ano? So, dito sa example natin, we have your 6x and 2x. So, first, you copy the first uh, term x squared. And then you add 6x, 6x plus 2x, that is 8x. Next, you just copy the last term, which is 12. Since it's positive, you copy the sign positive. And this is our final answer.